The second control of the prior to employment category is terms and conditions of employment. This control states that the employee's responsibilities towards information security should be included in his agreement with the organization. It is always more effective to ensure employees' responsibilities for information security up ahead, so they wouldn't claim negligence at any point of their employment. These responsibilities and obligations should be defined reflecting the information security policies and guidelines. The terms and conditions which an employee would be signing and abiding by, should include a non-disclosure agreement of any secret, critical, or sensitive information that he would be having access to. The agreement should include legal responsibilities, such as those dictated by copyright and data protection laws. The employee's responsibilities extends to protecting the organization's assets that they would be responsible for operating, handling, accessing or maintaining. Failing to abide by the terms and conditions agreed on, disciplinary actions should be considered. For third parties involved in projects related to information security, terms and conditions should be defined and agreed on as per the organization's requirements.